Hello everybody, this is a video, uh, this video is going to be a little bit different. I'm recording me uh, working on the testing for Digi the Husky, and currently I'm uh, working on some of the um, abilities, uh, working on currently a ability called Voodoo Dash, basically where Diggy just um, dashes, from, like quickly dashes through an enemy using Voodoo, because you know, that that's a thing in the game. And you can, like, dash through enemies. It's really fast. But, um, I've been working on it right now, and, uh, the whole reason why I'm recording this is solely because, uh, a person that approached me about, um, get, joining a game development team, uh, was disappointed that I didn't have anything about my game development on my channel. Like, I do now. I have the one, um, the one video for the scaffolding yard. But, uh, he was disappointed I didn't have any progress stuff for, um, game development, and I was just like, you know what, maybe I should just start doing that a little bit, and, uh, this ability, it's actually kind of cool, in my opinion, like, I really like how this one's going well, so I wanted to keep recording and see, like, just to document what I've been doing, I'm not even sure if this will come out, because, like, it might just completely fail, but so far, like, I just put in the, what I think is the right code for what I want, I haven't seen it yet, but, uh, hopefully this works. So, I'm just going to test this. Right. Uh, oh, I could be using my controller. Uh, uh, I just want to mention that as well. This game now has controller support, like I managed to get that going for me. I hate it. But, um, uh, if you're wondering what that white box is down the corner, that's um, the ability picture. Uh, in the, like, when I, like, so normally there should be a picture right there of what the ability is, but I don't have, um, I don't have, I haven't made a picture for this ability yet. I made one for patch for the main ability, but I haven't made one for this one. But this is just testing, so, yeah. Anyway, I'm just gonna test this and go. Oh, shit! Oh. That was cool. It worked, I guess. Uh, well, actually, effect didn't appear. So, okay, maybe, um, huh. Here's what I was going for. I was going for a thing where, um, Diggy, uh, goes translucent, or transparent, either one. And then he, uh, then he dashes through enemies, of course. But there's, like, a green trail behind him. And I was trying to get that, but for, I guess it didn't want to show up in the coding. Um, but, um, I also made it so that he moved a little too fast. Like, I wasn't expecting him to dash that far. Like, holy shit. I either need to turn down the uh, length that he dashes for, or I need to turn down uh, the like speed of him. Well, that's kind of cool, though. If we do, It moves with your momentum. So, like, of course, if I'm standing still, he'll just go straight. But uh, once I get my stamina back up, but if I just, if I, like, jump while I'm doing it, he goes up, like, along with the jump. That's kind of cool. There's a physics thing in this now. I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting him to go, like, that straight. Except that I can't make him go up. Let's go that way. But, eh. I can deal. So if I have him dash while he's going down, that means he'll go down, right? Yep, he will. Let's see, he can, he'll collide with the wall if he does this. Yep. Alright. Alright, so... I got the basic thing down. Now I'll show you the code, because, you know, now that's what I'm doing. Uh, most of this stuff is unused. Like, some of it's there, but some of it's not, actually. You know. Like, some of the stuff is a different function. Ignore that, please. Uh, that one right there. Um, oh, you, is, my, is my mouse not recording? Shit, I don't think my mouse is recording. Uh, whoops. Uh, one second. I'm gonna see if I can... See if I can... Hold on. One second, everybody. We'll pause this. Alright, now you should be able to see my mouse. If not, well, I fucked up. Uh, pardon my language. I'm a terrible... Terrible at... Conserving language. I really should, because this is an E-rated game. But, uh, yeah. Alright. That's not the right script. Source news. Alright, yeah. So... Something here I did wrong. Okay, so first of all, uh, 
okay, this is what makes Diggy, like, go. So maybe I could either turn down the velocity or turn down the duration. I'm going to try turning down the duration from... Well, not the, no, the duration's fine. I'm going to try turning down the velocity to, to 0.75, and that'll make him go slower. Or is that what I want? He seemed to go to fat. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'll just do that. And that's how long he's going for. The duration's how long he'll be dashing. Uh, this is just keep, what keeps him in the air. This is what makes him invincible, why he doesn't go through enemies. Uh, this is what makes him play the post. This is what I needed to work, and it didn't. The dash effect didn't work. I don't know why that is. It's set to go on to the main, so maybe this script just doesn't work, and I need to use a different one. That's supposed to cause the effect to happen where the green um, particle effect happens. Anyway. Uh, so, let's see. Sprites. Attach a sprite while I was using. So, if I up, caps lock it, I did. What am I doing? Where am I? Oh, I was typing stuff in. Uh, someone's laughing back there. Uh,. Hold on, so, yeah, play sprite is what I need. Maybe. Maybe that's what I need? It might work. Yeah, play sprite at a certain point in the map, that's not what I need. A certain point in the interface, that's also not what I need. Huh. Why doesn't it want to... So that's what, I was doing it correctly then. But it doesn't want to. Hmm. Watch something real funny up there, apparently. They're listening to me talking about them, then they're laughing. Try to be quiet back there, by the way. Uh, so, if I use... This is really distracting. <laughs> uh, do I use flash? Because hmm. I tried what I think... No, yeah, I did try making... His sprite, the one that causes the particle effect to happen, but that just made him invisible. So it's not the problem of the attached sprite not working. <laughs> it's the problem of just the effect not working for some reason. The effect itself is broken. That's what I needed to do. Say so I need to reattach sprite. Right, right. Attach. Sprites. You can also ignore some of these sprites because, yeah, some of these uh, are just for testing and stuff like that. Don't take any of them to heart. Um, dash effect. Normal code effect. Finish behavior disappearing. Or you attached. Uh, to the actor. Yeah, no, don't do that. Don't do that. Well. Mm, I don't think it'll be necessary. But attach that. So now I attached it, but how do, now I need to deattach it. And then, yeah, this is the one. It does attach. Deattach, at least. I don't know. So yeah, that's, I set that back to normal. But now I know that it's not the script's fault, it's the um, effect's fault, I guess. Let's see. Dash effects. It's supposed to be. Yeah, hold on. Particle options. Yeah, why doesn't it make a particle? Why doesn't it do a thing? It's set on. Starting capacity is full. There's no trailing. What if I changed it to trail? That would, well, first of all, that'd be bad, but. What's it with direction? Yeah, I feel like that's kind of necessary. Yeah, put it with direction. Uh, size change. Well, size code change. Let's see, post in a second. See, yeah, there it is. That's the problem. Like, see, this is um, just a like preview. 
it's supposed to look like this, except, you know, green. But, um, for some reason, preview continuously, when I start playing it, it doesn't want it, it disappears. So I need to know why it's disappearing. Huh. Weird. Alright, so, color unaffected overlay billboard. Maybe if I make it face X? Hey, it's doing the thing. What's it doing, though? That's a weird effect. What is it doing? I guess it's just disappearing and overlapping itself. It shouldn't look like that, though, but... Uh, what else? Test this. Let's see how it goes. I tested him in the air, I don't know why. What if we'll have music playing for this? I don't know. I'll probably just keep it silent. This, this, is, this is the one thing I hate about testing, like, it's showing the controls. Like, yeah, it's useful, but it's just like, it's a way of testing. I'm just trying to do things. Alright, go. Boom. Oh! It did it. It did it. It did the thing. Oh, it stops at some point. Oh. Oh, it does weird things. It's kind of glitchy. Mm. Alright, so that works. He still moves for a very long time. He's slower, but he moves for a very long time still. So. It's definitely faster than uh, his running still. So that's good. I think 75 is the right speed. But I need to lower it just a bit. But first, I'll edit the effect because it didn't look right to me, at least. Dash effects, but yeah, I made it kind of a bar for green. I don't know why I did that. Just make it normal, vibrant green. Hmm. All right, so the lifetime is 0.5 seconds. Maybe we should make the trail last longer. Yeah, maybe I should make it last one second. Frequency... Oh, how's this game? <laughs> Someone's talking. But, uh, let's see. Let's see, let's see. I really should disable that feature when I'm doing videos, like the email thing. But, you know what? Screw it. You guys can know what emails I'm getting, even though they might be, like, important or something like that. Or spoiler related to something, I don't know. It could happen. Um, anyway. Uh, speed change, size change, uh, seems to fade pretty well. So, yeah, rotate with direction, I think I want to get rid of that, because it was doing some weird shit right there. Alright, okay. Uh, my voice is kinda, kinda a bit of a weird today. Uh, let's see. Uh, dash. But did I just open up the same thing? I did. What's wrong with me? Uh, Alright. You know, I should start doing tutorials for a 001 engine. Like, I love this engine. And I constantly worked, like, on it, and, like, with, or, like, with it. And help fix it sometimes by reporting bugs, like I should. But, uh, like, I really like this. It's, like, one of my favorite engines. And, um, you know, I feel like other people would need, like, should learn how to use this. It's not hard. I, I self-taught myself, but, eh. We're looking through tutorials, but, I mean, tutorials and self-teaching myself. Uh, trial and error, all that goodness. That's what Threadbound was good for. It taught me a lot of the engine. Except that was for RPG. Now I'm kind of just learning about platforming. Um, alright, so the dash itself needs to be shorter. Alright, so that's the push. So, 0.75 is good. It's good speed. Maybe I should make this 0.3. How long he dashes. Get the pause in between. 0.3. Um, 
let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, rules smoothing, fly instant sustain, yep. Uh, you pick the door. Yeah. Alright. Change a few things now. You should do it for shorter, and the effect should look a little better and not glitch out. And we should add, I should add a sound effect for it too. While I'm at it. Well, not while I'm at it right now. Alright, it. Bam! It looks cool. It looks cool. I'm only complain that it just suddenly stops. And it's just like. Eh, it's not very flowing. Whoa, 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 what the heck happened there? See that? Now he's just dashing backwards. Or at least on the effect. He always goes that direction. Hmm. Maybe I should do this. Uh, yeah, now, he's, now that effect only goes backwards. But yeah, this seems perfect for right now. I'll have to test it with some enemies. So, but, uh, yeah. When they do it like this, it looks cool. Doing it the other way doesn't look cool. This is the problem I have with um, uh, doing the testing recording. I can't use the cheat codes to um, yeah, there's cheat codes in this, by the way, like here. But um, I can't use the cheat codes, well, like on screen, because then you'll know the cheat codes. I mean, yeah, eventually I'll have to show you guys the cheat codes somewhere or somehow. But I mean, hey, you know what? Actually, I'll just pause it while I do the cheat. Code and power. And I'm back with full stats. Alright. Uh, it looks absurd when you have full stats. Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's weird. I don't like that. Alright, so basically what I was doing there was... Uh, I have it set to where it will automatically... Um, like, if I just hold the button, it will automatically keep dashing. But, uh... Huh, it just stops in the middle of it. It's not like a free-flowing thing, it, it just halts. Hmm, I could fix that. But, uh, I mean, what are the what are the chances that you're going to have 300 stat? I mean, and then you're going to want to do da the dash ability three times. It's not, it's not necessary. You just got to dash, you got to dash. Can I fly if I do this? Hold on. If I do this correctly, maybe I could fly. I'd be amazed if I could fly, but I mean, let's go. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, I could last stay in the air, though. I could stay in there for quite a long time. Hmm. Yep. That's pretty chill. Bam, go, go, go. Yeah, that's pretty cool. What if I go bam and then oh. Forgot about the stamina feature. <laughs> Whoops. Gotta wait it out. That's my favorite thing to do. Go I miss being able to duck. Like I had to get rid of it for some technical difficulties. But sit like just waiting for something to happen or waiting for your stamina or waiting for a platform. It was so fun to just duck. And this little ducking animation was so cute, but I can't use it because Fuck stuff up. I keep cursing. Dang. Gosh darn. I don't know them, Facebook. Don't message me about random stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, wait. Was I seeing that right? Was there one under the ground? You guys saw that, right? Huh. That's your man. No, that's my imagination, probably. Huh. Yep. Alright. Uh, let's see. There's something else I need to do. Oh, yeah, I need to do combat testing for it. So, I'll just place an enemy down here. And, uh, and, uh, and the, some of these are still templates that the engine gives you, but I, I never use them. 
I, I don't know why I don't just delete them from the game. I will in the final, obviously, but, like, uh, eh, I miss my flag right now. Let's put a... Why am I so zoomed out? That's dumb of me. Switch my drawing tablet real quick. Should have been using a mouse, but, eh, why not? Why don't I just draw it up? Alright, so there's a bammer hammer. And, uh, I'll have it respawn so I can actually... So I can actually use, like... Keep testing without having to reset the other thing. Every in wall, blah, 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 blah. Um, if this works like I think it will, it'll hit him at the end of the thing, but that's not what I want. Every in <laughs> Shots fired. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I guess it, it doesn't matter. As long as it respawns. So, if I do this correctly, if I did this correctly, and it does what I think I, it'll do, it'll face through the enemy, and I hope that it hits it while he's phasing through. But, what I figure will happen is it'll face through, but it'll only hurt it if it's at the end of the dash, so, you go. Bam. Oh, well, I mean, he did it there. It hurt him. Well, I can dash through him, that's, that's for sure. But it does do exactly what it said. It dashes through, but only hits at the end. That's cool looking, though. That is pretty spiffy. I'm doing good things today. I wonder if there's a way I can make it so that it constantly hits. Because that's kind of useful, like, in terms of... Can I get stuck, though? There's a, like, if I land right in a tip box, I think I'll get stuck. Oh, yep, you can, you can absolutely get stuck. That is a thing that can happen. Yep, 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 that's bad. Oh. 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 Huh. What, uh, what is happening here? Uh, there's no memory position. Oh, okay. Right. It was the checkpoint thing. I forgot about that. Player enters. Memorize position. This is how the checkpoints work. Basically, um, uh, when I need a checkpoint, I, ha I have the game memorize a position. So when it runs, when Diggy runs by the checkpoint, it'll remember where, it'll remember that position, and when I want to remember the position or have Diggy go to that position, aka when he dies, then I have a go, um, have a script to go to position. That's that magic. Okay, well now I gotta test that, so. I'm hitting a belt on my wall, but, or uh, not my wall. Inside of my bed, by the way. I don't know why I'm doing that. Shots fired again. Fireworks. It's not Fourth July anymore. Calm down. Never that important. Bam. Kill me. Kill me. I love that. I love it and I hate it because it's just like I don't want Diggy to move when that happens. Oh, you know, that's an easy fix. It's such an easy fix. I just make it so that the left and right sprites are the same. Oh, I'm dumb. Oh, I'm so dumb. At least your checkpoint works, but, uh... Yeah. So, yeah. So, basically, um... Like, I had no control over, like, if you die, um... You can't... Uh, it won't show the left and right movement. I had no control over that. But I need to stop touching this belt. But, um, like, but I just figured out that a thing. It's the same thing I had with the, the victory pose. I just did this, the, had the sprite be the same on both left and right. Alright, hold on. Oh, but then if he dies the other way, it doesn't make sense. Um. Huh. That is indeed a problem. 
No, it's great. Uh, 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 I don't know if it matters right now. But I do know one thing. We gotta fix that last thing before I end this video. Gotta fix up the Voodoo Dash um, hitbox. Okay, so this is where all the magic happens over here with the attack. Uh, this is what tells. Which is what. This is what request, like shows. Alright then. This is what shows um, what it will take to use the ability. <laughs> this is what it takes to use the ability. Uh, basically, a hundred special points. So uh, yeah, I'm just pointing that out. Um, the track condition distance is basically the AI will know you're there from a certain distance if you use it within a certain range. And loss is just for things that require ammo. Uh, door. Uh, seeking is just for <clears throat> homing of projectiles. Oh, you know, I could make it a project. Why is it when I only do, like, when I do chocolate draws, right, I don't lose my voice. When I do things that aren't chocolate draws, I immediately start losing my voice. Huh? Hmm? Sure. Uh, well, I'll be there in a minute. Apparently we're shooting fireworks. Uh, close the door, by the way. So okay. professional. Um, alright, so, the hit, first of all, this needs to be Three seconds, point three seconds. So that's how long the dash is. Hmm. Maybe that'll help. Cause the use time is like when the enemy is hit. That much I know. Oh, you know what? If I make it two seconds, he he won't stop until the last one. Maybe just ooh. So maybe now that the whole like pausing thing might um cease to happen. Yeah. Alright, so let's see. Oh, well, now I gotta answer the T-code. Uh, one second. Alright. Oh, there it is. Now, uh, dash. Well, that didn't work. Hold on. Dash. Oh, it hits him in the middle of it. It's a little bit finicky, but it does work. Oh. Worked that time, that's for sure. Now if I do this... Wait, hold on. Yeah, it still stops in midair, but... If I hold it for all my stamina, then go... Yep, yep, oh, yep, it does it. I can just dash straight through. Yep, yep. Right, well, that, I didn't have the stamina for that. <sighs> the waiting in this game is what kills, kills me. Maybe it does a little too fast. Maybe if I do it back to 3.3 seconds, it'll be good. It'll be good to go. You know what, I like, yeah. I think it does it right. I think it's doing it right. I'm, I'm liking the result of the thing. It does it pretty much instantly. Yeah. You can't see me, he's facing the other way. Silly Billy. Alright. God, the stamina bar is so absurd. It is so absurd looking. <laughs> like, the length of it in comparison to, like, when you first start the game with only three. I mean, even the hits, it's like... Can you imagine just, like, actually trying to take damage for this long? You jumping on top of the goddamn thing. Yeah, the dash is good. So, okay, so when I do that, the dash seems strong. But when I run, it's very fluent. That's good. That's very good. And then when I do this, yep, still pretty fluent. And now I only try and charge it all the way up and try to fly. Get out of here. Oh. Forgot, uh. Oh, oh, Jesus. I had that equipped somehow. Losing health. Alright, let's try to fly. Yeah. Well, that, it looks weird when I did like that. I think it's just because of. I should lengthen the map out a little bit. 
Yes? I know. Do a good thing. Maybe maybe I should lengthen thing. Uh bip bip bip. Okay, yeah. That's good. Now I just need to have alright, you know what? I'm just gonna do a thing where I make the sprite face and everything. I don't need, I don't need to record that. You guys know how I do it. Man, you know what? No. I'm gonna record it. Uh, I'm just gonna change this uh, sprite back to have it face that direction as I go. Particle effects. Yep. Uh, rotate with direction. That's what I need. You'd think it played both directions. It doesn't. It doesn't do it. Odd. Or does it even help? Hold on. So if I do... Hmm. Maybe I should make the dash just... Like little green circles instead, because that, that has no direction, and it does, it, yeah, it has no direction. So, in either, oops, in either direction it would work. Okay, so going like that, that works. I don't need to have three bars right now. Good. Bam. No, it doesn't do it, because the sprite's not moving. Mm -hmm. I understand. Okay. It looks cool. It looks cool, I will admit that. But, I'll have to change it to a circle. Probably I'll have to change it to a circle. Because that's, uh, it doesn't want to go with Diggy. Because it's not Diggy's sprite. It doesn't know which direction he's going. Unless I make it f mm, I don't know if that's the thing. Hold on. Oh, you know what? That might be a thing. That might be a thing. Hold on. If I make it go... Not equipped. I was about to click on it. Uh, if I can have it attach sprite in a certain direction... No, I can't have it attach sprite in a certain direction. Dang it! Oh. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna make it a circle. Because the diggy thing looks cool, man, but I mean... You know, doesn't want to do. It's not my problem. Uh, delete. Clear. Yep. That's good. Plug in files. One, I guess. And then just make a circle. Add it. Make a green circle thing. Green. I can make a round with screw it. Well, I can make the circle white, too, I suppose. Dang it! Oh, they're lighting fireworks back there. I, I knew that, but I uh, didn't pay attention. <laughs> so the circle's green. Oh, that's too bright, though. If it starts out like that... Mm, mm, what if I make it, like... Hold on. I can make it a little bit more transparent with Diggy. That's a bit better. That's a little too tantrum, though. Hold on, what if I do this? And then... Put a bit more inward. Oh, yeah, I, I'm liking where this is going so far. I mean, that is a solid game. You know what, this is good. Save that. This is just test, so, you know. The effect will get better. You don't even watch me sprite. Particle options, uh, yep. Okay, I'm good. Alright. This I'm okay with. I think. Uh, we'll see. That looks pretty cool. Uh, what is that noise, though? Is that the firework? Weird. Damn. Oh. Oh, I broke it somehow. Got stuck in the enemy. 
I knew I'd manage it. I knew I'd do it. Dang it. I'll have to add it to where from still colliding with the enemy. I'll have to keep him transparent until he exits. But that could be that could break some stuff like that. That's gonna be pretty cheapsy duels. Cheapsy duels I mean. Oh, I wanted to make this a short video. We're gonna have to make it a little bit longer, I guess. Oh, now it appears. Well, and now it doesn't appear. What did I do wrong? Particle options. What if I make it not face X now? Why did it matter if it faced X before? I don't understand. I don't... What? That's not... Mm. Oh, wait, now... What? Now it's working. That's happening. I'll have to end this video soon, because they are going with fireworks, and A, I want to look at them, I want to light them off, and B, they're really loud. They are really, really loud. Alright. What happened there? What was that? What? I'll fix it later. Don't worry about it, guys. I got this. I'll see you later. That was that was a game development for you. I'll kill this guy. I'll, I'll fix it in the end game. You'll you'll see. He's dead. Goodbye.